a lot of times you want to change the color of something in Photoshop um, and this video shows you how easy it is to do with the adjustment layer for hue and saturation and I show you not only how to do this to change all of the colors in an image but how to select a particular part of your image and just confine the color change to that. So as you can see in this image this child is carrying a bucket with yellow flowers. My goal is to make that largest yellow flower a different color. So I'm going to do that by going up to the drop down menu for layer and getting a hue and saturation adjustment layer. And it's going to sit above my uh, image layer. So I'm sliding the hue slider around and I see that my um, flower is changing, but all of the colors in my image are also changing. So I'm going to switch from the master, which changes all colors. I'm going to focus on the yellow. And while that does um, give me a slightly better result, it's also getting anything that has yellow in the, um, in the image itself. So I'm going to switch this back to talking to all of the image. And I'm going to put this adjustment layer in the trash. So now what I'm going to do is go select the object selection tool. And I'm just going to marquee around this flower. This uh, tool does a really good job of making selections. Um, in, in this case, it did a great job. All I've got is that flower. And now with that selection, when I add another hue and saturation adjustment layer, we get the mask that focuses those changes only in the area that is white on the mask. And I can slide the hue slider around to like get the color that I like. I can also work with saturation if I want to or the lightness slider if I want to and I can also come back over to my layers panel and adjust the opacity of that a little bit if that's what I would like. So I have now achieved my goal of changing just the big yellow flower. So if I'd like a before and after picture, I'm going to use the crop tool to resize this canvas to make it smaller or bigger. In this case, I want to make it bigger. So I'm going to stretch this canvas out to twice its original size. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to uh, grab the layer, that first layer, and I'm going to uh, drag it to the make a new layer, which is going to copy it. I could also do this with Commander Control J. And, and once I have that new layer, I can go and select my Move tool, and by holding the Shift key and the Move tool at the same time, I can slide that, that extra layer out from underneath the adjustment, so I get a before and after shot. And now you know how to change the color of one part of your image without changing color in a different part of your image. And you also know how to extend your canvas with the crop tool.